Yo, team, what up? Uh, I'm actually in the South Island. These are the hydro canals. I'm, I've just arrived here. I'm just about to start fishing them. But this video is part two of my day with Sean. The part one I will link in the description. If you haven't watched that, go check it out and then come back and watch this one. Um, but yeah, you're going to like this one too. We catch a bunch of fish. Like it's the best that that section of the river has ever fished for me. Uh, yeah, let me know what you think. Like the video, subscribe, and uh, I'll catch you briefly at the end. There you go, here's a fish. Yep. Ooh! That's one of those freight train ones. <laughs> you watch the shoulders that guy's got. Holy shit. There was a sweet little jump. That guy just about got head height. Holy fuck. <laughs> no this guy is going psycho. I told you there's these ones with shoulders that are just freight trained. Yeah. This dude just jumped twice, nearly head height. I think I missed both of them, but. <laughs> Oh, he's wrecking the rest of the pool. Yeah. This guy's going to be about this long. Or, well, you know, really short. Yeah, but rugby ball. But this is a big one of those fish. Yeah. Big one. As, he, as, as I tightened up on him, I was like, that's a good fish. We, apart from the three jumps this guy's done, we haven't even been able to... Oh, there he is. I haven't really been able to see him. You really upset him. <laughs> oh, that's a great fish. That's a great fish. Who's going to jump with him? It is a great fish. Rain starting to fall. The river's rising. Heaps of time, bro. Just let him go. If he wants to go, let him have it. <laughs> but as far as fitness goes these fish are just like that specific I don't know what it is about this river it just produces a lot of them whoa well, why would you say that before he's in the net <laughs> oh right yeah yeah Oh, we did. A fucking stupid net. Oh, that's the fish of the day. Oh, rugby ball. Fresh as a daisy. Solid fish like fish like that fight so hard. Rugby ball out of the grass. So good. All this. What well up, bro? Woo. He's, ready for, he's ready for round two. Thanks, buddy. Oh, another good one. Yeah. You see it taste that small fish? Yeah, that other fish. I think it just scared the shit out of it or something. Yeah. <laughs> Is this another? This another tank. Rugby ball one. Not as big. But... It's still that that shape of fish, I think. So I wasn't recording for the hookup of this fish, but it's about third cast after the uh, after the last one. Slightly smaller, but a very fine. 
a very fine specimen to the kick GoPro sweet bro There. Yeah, almost touching the tree. Yeah, in that, in that uh, channel there. Yeah. And fishing it out towards that pool, not towards me. Yeah. I mean, they do start, they do sit in this little soft edge, but most of them come from like right in that main flow. It's quite, quite, quite weird. So that's a lot heavier. Beautiful. Yeah, just keep that going. Is the rocket ship version? <laughs> he took it really on early in the drift too, eh? Yeah. Maybe he'll be nice and come over to us. I doubt it. Oh, I just scared another. Oh, he just scared another one up there. Oh, dude. I'll go chase him. Heaps of time, no rush. I'll chase him. Yeah, heaps of time though, we'll get we'll get him. I'll chase him. We'll work him over there. Yeah, keep that head up. Boom. It's a fucking nice fish too. I thought he was small. <laughs> Six. No, not quite. He's Four. nearly five. Nearly, nearly five. five. Holy shit. I, I thought he was like two and a half, three pound. <laughs> That's what I say to you. I'm pulling as hard as I can. Wow. If you had lost that and you had said he was about five pound, I never would have believed you. That would have been a fisherman's tail, hey? Oh, I, th I honestly thought he was like two and a half, three pounds. Even when he jumped, though, I didn't think he was that big. Here you go, buddy. Well done. Good fishing. You did really well to keep him in that pool at five pounds. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Yeah. Hey, bro. Good fishing, man. You can then go whenever you like. Oh. <laughs> hey. All right, so... You got him. So you, you only want this few feet in front of him. You could start the flies left if you wanted because the water's kind of pushing that way. I wouldn't oh, just I, fed. I wouldn't push them too far right of him. Is he still there? I just want to move. Um left and right. Yep, he's left now. Now he's going back right. He just come up high oh, in the water. I think it is a brown. No pressure. So he's on the inside still. It's the left, so a little longer, a little longer and a little right. Slow, slowly, slowly get that out of there. And you've got to go further right. He's coming. He looked, it was too, too short, too far right. I'm going to move in here yep. to do an overhand pass. Yep. Just quiet feet when you go in. It should be right in front of you. Ah, <laughs> uh, yep. I can you can you see him from there? No, not a glimpse. Just remember that that water right under your rod tip is really moving. So it can create a... This is better. This is better. Still there? Yep, he's still there. Yeah, that looks good. Oh, that's perfect. He, that kind of spooked him a little. Let's just rest him for a second and that change little, that, that again. That little, yeah. 
that it was the right line. Yeah, I think maybe that it splashed right behind him. Yeah. I think that may have just like woke him up a little. And then the fly was there, so we'll just change the fly again. No biggie. No biggie. As long as he stays there, I'm happy. Still there. Yeah, he's still there. But that was that was the right cast. Might just the water. There is no. Yeah. Hmm. If this doesn't work, we might try the old third person soft tackle. Yeah. Uh, try it one more time right and then we've got to change that. It's got to go right. That's pretty good. That's really good. Motherfucker. All right, we're going to change this. Not one more time? No. Nah. Oh, that went, that went right in front of his face. He had every opportunity to eat that. I'm just going to make this slightly longer. But like the first three casts were left, yeah. so he can watch it. He's like going, oh, one, yeah. two. Oh yeah. And then it's here and he's like, oh yeah, I saw you before. I saw you before, yeah. So that's why like first up casts are like Come on. money. Money for jam. And it seems like it's a pattern. It takes me three to get it right. Oh, we'll just try this, this one fly first. It's a little deeper. Okay. Let's try a gold bead one. Did I try that before? <clears throat> Let's try a gold bead one. Let's try this guy. If we if we're not absolutely positive he's eating it, don't do I mean you can set the hook but don't like rip it. Unless um, if you're positive he's eating it, then yeah, go for it. But if we're just like it just stops or hangs up, yeah. don't, don't assume do it. it's the fish. And hopefully this isn't too heavy. It's a little longer. I just want to make sure it. Because the last two times he's, he did look, he had to come up. Yep. So I just want to get it on his level a little. Still there. Yeah. Really aim right. I don't want any more down his left hand side. Let's give his right hand eye a workout. Oh, come that was pretty right. <laughs> it's probably a rainbow after all this. I think it is a rainbow. You don't want to go any longer than that. Slow lift, go. Woo! Keep him this side of the rock if you can. He's pretty pissed. If he goes around the other side of that rock, you need to walk out there to go over the top of it. I don't even think it's a rainbow. No, I think it's brown. I just said that so you'd cast better. And I did. <laughs> Don't want to play him too hard downstream. I don't even care if we if he takes us around this corner, that's fine. Oh, brownie jumps. <laughs> no rush. No rush. Just do a bit of rod angle this way. Heaps of time. Let him go. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, we had to wait for that. He weighs about 10 pounds at the moment, but I got a few rocks in there. <laughs> Yeah, it's 
sorry. That was a sick fish. That was, uh, he was so well behaved. We got some nice photos, got some nice video. And then he just decided he was uh, ready to go, which is fair enough. All right, so as you can see, we caught a buttload of fish. Uh, fly of the day was definitely that little soft tackle, which is this fly right here. You can get that from Telpa Run Tackle. Any fishing store should have it, but um, if you can't find it, check out Telpa Rod and Tackle which is also linked below and they'll find it for you. Um, it's kind of a hard fly to fish because it is unweighted, it's very very light uh, but if you can get it in front of fish then generally they've got no problem eating it. Also I just have to give a very quick early happy birthday to Nick Hensman. Uh, I will be seeing you in a couple of weeks time uh, for two days awesome fishing hopefully. Uh, yeah looking forward to that and we'll catch up soon buddy. But that's the video, I really hope you guys enjoyed it click the like click subscribe you know what to do and uh, I get to fishing this and filming four or five videos for you so subscribe to make sure you don't miss what happens in these canals there's actually a fish right there I'm about to rig up a rod and see if I can catch it all right peace